guys, welcome back. Today we're looking at the Pure Imagination Collection from Calorista Carol, which releases today on March 17th. So this collection really is a rainbow. There's every kind of color here, and they all have the same beautiful two coat formula. I was able to get everything absolutely opaque in two coats, and they're all bold but soft linear holographics. What makes these polishes different is that each one has some added fine micro iridescent glitter in different colors. So depending on the polish, you are gonna see them in different colors. And then also there's a top coat to go with it at the end. So let's get into swatching. On my lips, I have this Wet n Wild Pout and Love. It's just the shade love and it's a glossy balm um, with a little bit of color So this one actually has quite a bit of color and I'm really enjoying it on my nails is one of my favorites from the collection So let's go ahead and get started So I'm gonna go in alphabetical order like I do a lot of times on my channel just because it makes it easier for me to keep things straight So the first polish in the collection is called a quiver and to be honest the first week that I had this I was pronouncing this aquifer in my mind but this is a quiver, so like when something is trembling with excitement. Um, okay, so this is a magenta linear holographic. It is bold but soft. And the fine iridescent micro glitters in there shift from blue to purple. It's like a blue-purple mix. And I'm going to be showing you two coats. I'm going to do two coats of everything so you can see how these totally get opaque at the two coats. And then I will show you a swatch photo indoors, both so you can kind of see what the color is going to look like inside. And I also want to be able to take you outside and show you a swatch in the sunlight so that you will see all the beautiful hollow shine bright. And so this first one is a quiver. The next polish in the collection is a beautiful purple linear holographic. This is called Curious. More accurately on the website, this is described as a bright grape. And the micro iridescent glitters in there are blue green. So gorgeous idea for the combination here. As always, we are gonna do two coats for the swatch here and then I'm going to show you a picture indoors and outdoors so that you can see how it would look depending on where you're at. So this one is Curious. Next up we have this corally red. I know this is gonna be a lot of people's favorites. This color is just so stunning. This one's called Daydream. And this, um, like I said, is a corally red base, linear holographic as with the rest of them. And then the fine iridescent micro glitters in there are orange to green. Isn't that cool? So you're looking at two coats here on my nail and then we're gonna take some photos indoors and outdoors. And here you have Daydream. Okay, this next polish is the one that I have on my nails, and this is one of my top picks for you. When do I pick a pink polish as a top pick? Rarely ever, right? This one's called Discovery, and this is a bold pink linear holographic, and the micro iridescent glitters in here are purple blue, and one of the reasons this one is my favorite, it applies just as nicely as the rest of them. It's not really about formula. All of the formulas are great. But I felt like I could really see the blue and purple in here and it just really shone so bright. Every time I put this on, it just made me so happy to see that purpley blue bounce off of a pink holographic. It was so fun. So for that reason, this is one of my favorites. So you've been looking at two coats of Discovery with an indoor swatch and an outdoor swatch. So we're gonna be looking at a number of my favorites here right in a row. My next favorite is this yellow. This is actually kind of yellowy green. This is called Elysium and I just love this. I really don't have enough yellow holographics and I don't have any that are this color. So definitely a favorite for me. The micro iridescent glitters in here are the orange to green mix. This polish is just, I mean, you guys know, I love yellow, and so when I saw this was in the batch, I was just like, yes, I already know before I put it on, I'm gonna love it, because I already knew the formula would be great. Um, but yeah, an icy cool yellow green, so awesome. Okay, another absolute favorite for me out of the collection is this beautiful Kiwi Linear Holographic. I mean, do you guys have any other Kiwi Linear Holographics? This is too cool. Absolutely a favorite for me. Again, when I got it out of the package, I knew I was gonna love this. This is called Fantasia, and this has that same orange to green micro glitter in it that the last one that we looked at has. I just love this color so much. I mean, how can you not like that? It's so, so beautiful, and I can really see those orange glitters just Absolutely recommend this one for sure. Fantasia.
The next polish in the lineup is the blue, and this is a cerulean blue. And the micro glitters in here are going from lime to gold. This is called Infinity. So beautiful. We're going to swatch it two coats just like the rest. I'm going to give you an indoor shot and an outdoor shot. So you can really see how this polish plays depending on the different lighting. So this one is called Infinity. Next up we have Mirage and this is another pink. This one is described as a soft pink linear holographic and it has that same blue purple very fine iridescent micro glitter in there and this one is very similar to my favorite pink in the collection Discovery. It's just like a little bit lighter and it has the same um, fine micro glitter in there as well. They're both very beautiful. I just felt like I could see the micro glitter a little bit better in Discovery. But yeah, this swatch is so great just like the rest of them. We're looking at two coats of Mirage and then some indoor and outdoor photos. Some really great pink polishes to choose from in this collection. All right, the next polish is an orange linear holographic. Yay, an orange! This one's called Muse. To be fair, it's not just straight up orange. It's like an orange sand look, but I mean, you guys, I was just saying the other day how much I love orange linear holographics and I need more of them. So this applies so beautifully in two coats just like the rest. And the iridescent micro glitter in there is that lime gold mix again. <sighs> so beautiful. I love this one so much. It's not like so orange that I wouldn't feel totally comfortable just wearing this as a neutral every single day of my life. Love it, love it. This is again one of my top picks. I really recommend this one. So now we're gonna look at the topper. This one is called Stargazer. So this is in a clear base, of course, as toppers are. And this one is actually not hollow micro glitter. This is hollow micro flakes. So it's gonna give it a little bit denser look on the nail. So beautiful. And it also has all four of those different kinds of the iridescent micro glitters in there. The lime gold, the purple blue, the orange to green, and the blue green. And so you have all that combined into this awesome topper. I think I swatched it for you here over black, but I took a photo of it over a red just to kind of give a few different options. So yes, stunning. It's like a rainbow within a rainbow. Actually, all of these polishes kind of are, huh? But since this has all four of those kinds of the micro glitter, it really is a rainbow within the rainbow. Let me remind you what my favorites are. I know, I can't even believe it myself as I'm looking here. I didn't pick the purple this time, and not because it wasn't great. I was just so blown away by these ones. So I picked Discovery, and that one was the slightly darker pink with the purpley blue in it. Then I picked Elysium, which is that beautiful yellow. Absolutely must have if you love yellows. Pick that one up. Um, then the Kiwi, hello, of course. I love that one so much. It's just absolutely the standout from the collection. When I look at it, it just, my eye just goes right to that and the yellow. And then, of course, the orange called Muse. The green was Fantasia, by the way. So we have Discovery, Elysium, Fantasia, and Muse. Those are my favorites. But as you guys saw, they all apply exactly the same. It just depends on what color combos you like in there and which ones you feel like rocking. So that's it, you guys. I hope that you found this helpful. Like I said, these are available now. I will link the website down below so that you can go check them out. They do have a special pricing if you pick up the whole bunch. And remember, the Chlorosecurel polishes do give you a nice healthy amount of product, 15 milliliters in these bottles. So that's gonna wrap it up, you guys. Thanks for spending some of your day with me today. I will see you back for the next review. I hope you guys go out and have a super weekend. In fact, come back tomorrow for Swatch Fest. I will see you then, you guys. Take care, bye.